Welcome back everyone. In this video I'm just sort of covering off on the problem that I found in the last one where when moving the x-axis the y-axis was moving as well. I put it down to a to the belts being a problem in the last video and I've since changed them and it's all looking pretty good now. Anyway let's take a look at the video. So in this video we look at my fix for the problem I showed in the last video where the Y axis was moving when we only moved the X axis. The belts have been replaced and let's take a look at the result. So I've put all of the Marlin settings back to where they were as far as steps per millimetre and stuff like that that I was jigging around with last time and just got proto face loaded up and I've homed everything uh, well let's just home it again let's home the X now if I just step it across in 100 millimeter steps you'll notice that we don't have any movement of the Y axis so Basically, the problem was those belts were ratchet. Now, I don't know whether it was because they were just cheap from China and just crappy quality, <coughs> or whether maybe I've tightened them up too much at some point in time and have stretched them or something ridiculous like that. But at any rate, uh, that certainly seems to resolve the issue, so I'm going to slip this back out to the garage now and free up my workbench again and start printing some stuff. Okay, and this is the difference. See how crappy that is, how out of shape it is. This is the latest one that has come off and it looks great so there you go problem solved shitty belts if you like what i'm doing then please do like the video if you'd like to see more then please subscribe and don't forget to hit the chime so you get notified when i post something new and i'll put a couple of links here to some other videos you can look at